Hi, welcome to another episode of Amputee Outdoors. I'm your host, Glenn, and today we are going to get to a review of the, make sure I pronounce this, Lilaka Pixie Hammock. This is it. This is the entire hammock right in here, okay? Now, it doesn't come with straps, and this comes from Ukraine. So I want to thank all those folks out in the Ukraine who make the Lilaka Hammock for this. They sent this to me for free to keep for me to do a review. So I guess you can consider this a paid review because I get to keep the hammock. Um, well, let's get this set up and get out, of, get it out of this bag and see how it looks. All right. Now, as always with hammocks, I review them on setup, comfort, features, things like that, craftsmanship, material. So I gotta say right off the bat, I like the fact that it's so small. This is gonna make, I'm guessing, the perfect day hammock. I don't know if this is really gonna be a full-on going out camping for a few days and sleeping in it overnight kind of hammock, but for a day hammock, this is probably gonna be just what I need. So let's see. All right, so it's got this nice tiny little bag. Okay, now the first thing I notice is that it comes with this long string here. Now I'm thinking this is supposed to go around the tree and then tie off around a tree. And if that's the case, then that's a big no-no. We don't do ropes around trees, do we? Everyone knows that. You use straps a minimum of one inch wide when you're going around uh, trees and stringing up your hammock. Just so happens, I have straps with me here to be able to do that. So what I'm gonna, what I've done here, I've already tied this one. I tied a loop here at the end. And what I'm just gonna do is get on my carabiner and loop into my, uh, my straps that have gone around the tree. The tie off at the end here is a very clever little knot. Let me just get that in close so you can see that. Okay, that's nice. I'm not sure. It looks like they've threaded it through a channel and then wrapped it around and tied it off to secure it. That's a pretty good way of doing it. I'm just curious of whether over time the, uh, the string, the rope here, would kind of wear against the material and eventually degrade it somehow. I'm not sure. The material itself is ridiculously light. You like the color? I like the color. I'm going with bright colors for my camping and hiking stuff so that when I drop it in the dark, I can find it. The material, like I said, is really light, really soft. All right, let's get the rest of this out here. Okay. Pretty good size hammock. Let me get this strung up and I'll bring the camera in close and we'll have a look at some of the features and some of the details, okay? Hang on for just a minute while I do that. All right, so. This little bag, Oop, let me get that turned right side out. Lilica Pixie Hammock. This little bag here had this hammock in it. Let me bring you over here. All I've done here, I've just done a uh, lark's head with a carabiner, tidal loop, connected it that way. Bring in closer, you can see how that's connected. The tie off in there. Okay. The hammock is roughly nine foot long, I think. Its usable length is probably going to be just short of six foot. And uh, I'm going to try laying in it now and seeing how comfortable it is. I, as you can see, I probably don't have a dead on 30 degree angle with my hang. Well, maybe. That's close. But now I'm going to get in it and see how it feels. All right. Hang on for just a minute while I set the camera up to do that. All right, let's get in this hammock and see how it does, okay? Pretty good so far, pulling my weight. The material, kind of slick, very smooth, kind of like that. Um, so let me pop my leg off in my boot and lay down in this hammock and see how I like it. Take up the prosthetic. Leave that right there. Oh, let's see now. Oh yeah. This is pretty good. This is, this is good. You know what? This feels really nice. It's very light. I can feel the breeze under me. There's 
you, I mean, it's a ridiculously thin material. You can feel the air underneath you. Um, I'm guessing mosquitoes could probably bite through it, but I'm not going to worry about that too much. I do have a bug net that I got from um, Roman uh, Ventures, I think it is. Yeah, great bug net. covers everything 360. So I could bring that along if bugs are going to be a problem for me. But, um, yeah, for, you know, just laying in a hammock, this is great. This is a great day hammock or a hammock that you could just string up in the backyard just to relax in. Uh, oops. <clears throat> Knocked my leg over. That's not good. So, I think for a day hammock, this is probably pretty good. Um, the quality of the work seems very nice. I'm not happy with the strings that are attached. I'd like to see those come in as straps. That would be much better. Um, and the way it's tied off at the end, I'm not 100% sure that's not going to wear the material over time and cause it to uh, stress and perhaps rip. That's a possibility. Um, time will tell. We'll see. If it does, maybe I'll give an update on this video. Um, but right now, i got to say that for a day hammock, uh, this is great. And of course, it packs down to that little tiny container, right? I can just toss that to my backpack wherever I'm going and then another you know, the little bag with some straps in it and I'm good to go wherever I go. Um, and of course I like the color, I like the bright color, it's great. So I think um, what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to give this a 3 out of 5. Um, for a day hammock, this is probably just what you want. Uh, I would give it a higher score, but I'm a little worried about how it's connected at the ends and I'm not completely happy with the fact that it just comes with the strings and doesn't have the straps. Um, if it just came with a string and it tied off at the end just as a loop and it was like six inches long, I would just think to myself, oh, they just don't mean the strings to be there. This is supposed to be bought separately from straps. Okay, fine. But with the strings there, I think to myself, oh, they want me to use the strings to tie around the tree, which is not good. So I take points off for that. So maybe in the future when they make these, they'll um, include straps or just make it a shorter piece of string with uh, a note, please purchase straps separately. We have those available at our website as well, or something like that, okay? So three out of five for this hammock, and um, I'm gonna enjoy taking a nap in this right now, I think, because it's a beautiful day. I've just done a hike, and uh, I can do with a nap. So thank you for joining me here on NPT Outdoors. Uh, thank you for uh, watching my review of the Lilica Pixie Hammock. If you thought this video was good, give me a thumbs up. Um, give me a subscription there. Down there'll be a button somewhere in one of the corners. It's the round one. Just click on that. And uh, of course, as always, I hope to see you out and outdoors, enjoying nature, relaxing in a hammock. Bye now. Ah. You still watching? The video's over. Just go hit the subscription button. I'll talk to you later.